Bonjour mes amis, c'est moi Stephanie and welcome to your workout Wednesday. Uh, yeah, we're here, things are happening and I thought this week we might need a little, uh, little high intensity uh, interval training. It's not, it's not really, it's sort of Pilates style or say yes, Stephanie style. Um, but we're going to come to standing and you have lots of choices and it's going to be kind of a whoo, quick way to get into our body but also just generally a quick one to get on with our lives, yeah? And again, thank you for sharing your lives a little tiny bit with me here on Wednesdays and every other Monday. Thank you subscribers for being here. Welcome new subscribers. Don't forget to hit that bell, everyone, for those workouts and those quick tips every other Monday. So come on up to standing. And I like to be on the diagonal, so I'm gonna be on a diagonal. And we're just gonna start with a squat. Whatever, it doesn't have to be anything fancy. You know, you can go all the way down if you want. I'm gonna go kind of here because this knee needs a little something, something for me today. I'm gonna turn my legs out and, and bring them pretty wide as well because that feels better. Uh, and I'm gonna take my hands on my thighs. Again, you might do something like this. Actually, this is kind of a nice one too. But just get into your plié. Allongé, plié, allongé, plié, bend and stretch. Send your booty back. And again, generally keep the head up so we're in a bit of an arch there. This is actually a really, if you find yourself, <laughs> again, uh, you know, currently in this season or whenever, needing a little, oh, I'm feeling on fire or like a volcano, do a little bit of what we're gonna do fully today. Even this is great and it, it clears the nervous system in, for lack of a better word or a little, uh, better phrase, but that's essentially what it does. <sighs> Let's do four. I'm gonna bring my hands here. Three, two, and one. <sighs> Face a different direction. That's once we get to your choice of the full, whatever your full variation is, we're just gonna keep, we're doing a bunch, change direction. Whew, I'm already out of breath. So the only difference now, if you wanna join me there or here, is to squat down and then whoo, rise up to tiptoes. Down and up, down and up. And I'm really actually liking this. I'm switching my clasp. Ooh, every time. Sending the crown of my head up, my booty down and back. Join me in that exhale down, inhale up. It's actually a great way to, um, let me get my breath again. Connect into our pelvic floor and deep core. And three. And two, and one. Ah. Okay, are you on fire? Me too. Again, face a different direction. The final uh, potential variation, again, depending on your knees, your hips, your joints, um, is, is to take that into, uh, take that into a jump. So go ahead and make sure, you, these are pretty squishy, so make sure your surface is supportive of your joints. And then as we, if you wanna join me in the jump, the squat jump, it's really to roll through the feet, yeah? So it's like we're going to releve and then lifting off and then coming back down. I know that's quick and dirty, but as rather than flat foot essentially, yeah? So find a new direction. And again, you don't have to do that variation. You can go back to the squats, or I would recommend if, if the, the releve feels good, go back to that no need to jump. But if you want to jump, join me. Here we go. <laughs> down, sorry, down and up, and up, and up. Four, three, two, one. Whew. Notice we did a few less there. That's because of me. <laughs> because now what we're going to do is do a bunch of whatever version. The squats, the squat lifts, which I would recommend, or the squat jumps. 
So either of the latter two, but of course, if the squat is what you want to do, go for it. Uh, it's again to clear quickly. Um, and I'm not going to speak as much. I'll just count for us sort of. Um, so let's go ahead and find your variation, find a new direction. And maybe I'm just going to be here. <sighs> Catch your breath for a moment. Thank you. Here we go. Well, again, we'll do a bunch of sets. Ready? And down up. And four. And three. And two. And one. Take a moment to just find your feet. After that, we're going to bounce. Again, another way to clear not only that energy, that effort that we just did, but also to help our nervous system calm down. <sighs> Easy breath. Bounce, bounce, bounce. So we'll do this bounce in between each set because <sighs> it helps in so many ways. All the ways. <sighs> Turn the dial down. Take a moment just to be. Face a new direction and whatever version of your squats, go for it. Ready? And four, three, two, one. And bounce. Glue your feet to the ground. Think, though it's sort of violent, but think jackhammer. Yeah, because they get deeper and deeper. So with every brr bounce, we are sending our feet into the earth, connecting a little bit deeper. Easy breath. And again, turn the dial down, take a moment of stillness. Find a new direction, new space, and let's go for it. Down and up. Four, three, two, one, and bounce. Can you already feel? It's almost like the juice is flowing, <laughs> literally. <sighs> or again, that's always my hope. I don't want to assume anything that's going on in your body. But I hope. <sighs> and turn the dial down, take a moment of stillness. Again, find a new space, a new facing. And down up, here we go. Four, three, two, and one, and bounce. Turn the dial down, find a moment of stillness one last time. New facing, new space. Make sure your mats are all where they need to be. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm able to take uh, more of a sighing breath, which is helpful, again, to calm that parasympathetic nervous system, or calm in too. Here we go. And down up. Four, three, two, one, and who bounce. Bouncy bounce. I'm going to move onto my mats a little differently. Oh, and again, turn the dial down. Oh. Take a moment to keep your eyes closed or close your eyes. Feel your feet, feel your breath. With your eyes closed or, or feel free to open them, soften your knees and just roll down and up.
when you're ready, take that roll up. <sighs> take a big sigh. Maybe that happened naturally like it did for me anyway. Thank you so much for being here and bearing with my breath. Uh, I hope you're feeling whew, warm and big and grounded. I'll see you soon.